I bought myself a nice Ford Sierra Cosworth. Well, what we've all been waiting for, the final race in Forza Horizon 2. Final race, air quotes, yes I know it's not the final race, yes I know there's more of a game after this. The Horizon Finale, race objective, just finish in the top three. That's all I have to do, really? Oh, I'm starting second. Hey, I'm racing my twin. Long lost okay, twin, how are you doing? Focus, how you doing, buddy? Do my boy. Jesus, so we are in for one hell of a trip. So in case you didn't know, this race takes around 15, 20 minutes, depending on how good you are. Probably, probably gonna take me around a good half an hour to complete. So uh, get the popcorn ready, lads, cause uh, this is gonna be a long one. Oh, what an entry, what an entry. Holy crap, that was unintentional. I mean, completely intentional, yep, did it on purpose. I'm an excellent driver. So, I hope you guys have been doing well. I have been doing lovely, lovely, of course. I, uh, I haven't been doing too much, to be quite honest. I've just been making a whole bunch of videos. I haven't really had time to do. Land it! <laughs> what the hell? So, in the final race, I've already pulled a massive drift entry. Completely intentional. And then a barrel roll. Three quarters of a barrel roll. The, the final quarter was a bit cheaty. We'll ignore that though. So yeah, I, I haven't had time to do too much other stuff than record videos to be quite honest. It's been taking a really, really long time to put four videos together each day. Oh boy, it's a lot of work, but it is so much fun. But today, however, I don't, I don't think there'll be four videos today because I'm doing a little live stream for you guys. Uh, I know a lot of you guys wanted me to get back into the holy shit a lot of you guys wanted me to get back into live streaming, so that is what I'm going to do. Uh, so I will be live streaming a little bit later today. Uh, so if you're watching this, when the video comes out on October 10th, I will be doing a live stream. Uh, I will put up a separate video for it saying, Hey, I'm live right now on Twitch, so come and watch. Uh, so get ready for that. And also, yeah, like I said, we're going to do a live stream today. We're going to be playing some Forza Horizon 2. And I don't really know what we're going to do. I think we're just going to go do some racing, do some online stuff. It should be fun. Should be fun. So yeah, it will be on Twitch. The link for that is going to be in the description below if you want to go uh, follow me on Twitch. But uh, I will be putting a video up here. I will be uh, tweeting when I'm doing it, when I go live, everything like that. So yeah, hope to see you all there. It should be fun. Holy shit, I'm in fourth. Look at the guy in first. He's all the way up there. I got to do some major work if I want to catch him. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh boy, this isn't going well. Shitload was backflips. Oh freaking hell. I'm in I'm in nearly last. This isn't going well. At, at, at least one person in your class. Holy shit, I just made up like 10 places or or maybe like 5 or 6, but let's let's be honest, it's more like 10. So, so I did actually want to tell you guys a little school story today, uh, a way to annoy your teachers an incredible amount. Probably will get you kicked out of class, may get you detention, but anyways, how to annoy your teachers 101. So, if you would like to get thrown out of class, this is how you do it. Uh, go, go to up to the kid in your school, every school has this kid, with the Bluetooth speakers. Every school has this guy, maybe you're that guy watching this right now. So if, if, if you're one of those guys, get your Bluetooth speakers, put them in the tissue box. Oh shit, oh you're, you got a bad rear end now. And you missed the checkpoint, but it doesn't matter for you apparently. So yeah, get, his, get the Bluetooth speakers and put them in the tissue box. Step one complete. Step two is to just start playing music from it. Teacher is going to be very, very confused and wonder where the hell the sound is coming from. This is an okay option. If you would like a very good option, you can start playing sexy time noises. This method will surely get you thrown out of class and probably make the entire class erupt in laughter. At least it did for mine when one kid did it in my class. It was too freaking funny. So yeah, you can do the music thing. Music thing's pretty good though, not bad. But if you want to step up the game, play some sexy noises, you know, you know, like the, never mind, I'm not going to do it, I was about to do it, that would have been dumb. 
Uh, you can, you can do that. You know what I'm talking about. Go on some of your favorite websites, because you know you have them. And, uh, just, just start playing some stuff. Have some fun. And, uh, then, then get thrown out of class, probably get detention. And, and maybe even get sent home, depending on how strict your school is, so... Enjoy! So yeah, that's a pretty good way to get thrown out of class. A guy did it at my school, and it was too funny, and I thought I would share it with you guys today. So yeah, but basically what he did is he came into class before the teacher got into the room. So yeah, before the teacher got into the class, he decided to hide his Bluetooth speakers in the tissue box at the front of the class, and uh, then started playing some music, and then someone gave him the great idea to play some fun noises. And then the entire class erupted in laughter. So yeah, that's one thing that we did at school. It's, it, I really don't recommend it because teachers get very annoyed when you mess up their class and stuff. But um, yeah, yeah, we, we kind of screwed around a lot, as you can probably tell by my previous stories. Oh shit, he's catching up. As you can probably tell by my previous stories, we like to screw around a lot and push the limits, even if it meant getting detention. This guy in my class actually got detention for it, but he was like, worth it. It's worth it. This is an incredibly long race. I'm only at 70%. Holy crap. One thing I just wanted to bring up again was the things we were talking about in yesterday's video with like, where's the best place to be a driver in the world? Some of you got, guys brought up some very, very good points. You guys uh, spoke about, if you're not into certain types of cars, then hey, then you then you can cut off some place or add some places, I should say. like. Say you're not a fan of JDM cars. You can live in the States, no problem. There were two places though that won basically the majority of the that the majority of the people basically agreed on. So one of them, Germany. Germany is really good for apparently they have low taxes, you can get basically any car you want. Uh, you can modify your car any way you want. And they have the Autobahn, right? Which has no speed limits and things like that. The other place that a lot of you guys agreed upon that was a really, really good place to own a lot of cars was New Zealand. You guys said very low tax, you can get any car you want, any modifications you want, and it's just a super cool place to drive. So yeah, those two places definitely up there. So if you're a rich millionaire and want to shit, if, if, you want, if, you, if you're a rich millionaire and you would like to shit, go get a toilet. So yeah, if you're a rich millionaire and would like to uh, go buy a bunch of cars, Germany or New Zealand, those are your two best bets. So, there you go. Fun fact. Aw, oh, balls. I can't believe it's come down to this, not even like two weeks after the games come out and we're technically on the final race. Don't worry though, a lot of people have said, hey, will this Let's Play stop when you've done the game, when you're done the game? No. We still have 16 more championships to go or whatever it is till we 100% the game, or no, sorry, it's 100, or no, it's 152 championships left. So enjoy the 152 videos to come, maybe, or or until you tell me to piss off. That's probably more likely. But um, yeah, I will be doing I will be doing some more let's plays. However, I will I will do one more today, at the end of today, and then on this this weekend I won't have let's plays just just because I'm gonna take the weekend off to just post some drift stuff because I know you guys want to see that. I've been I've been sort of slacking on the drift stuff and uh, posting a hell of a lot of let's plays instead. I will definitely be doing something with the live stream. I don't know if I'll be posting it, but it should be good. It should be very, very good. So here we go, 99% and across the line in first place. Only a little bit of rewinding was necessary. 15 minutes flat, not bad. Not bad at all. All right, so for those of you who haven't seen the final cutscene, obviously spoilers, but here you go. You totally owned it. Your first big Horizon win. Nice one. Congratulations. And the crowd goes wild. Yay. Hey, look, my friend's standing back there with the yellow shirt. All right. You've proven you know what you're doing. So I'm going to hand things over to you now. You get to choose the road trip and pick where we're going. But this time, I'm going to be in the pack. So come on, champ. Let's see what you got. You going to go for it? This is going to be fun. Well, that's it, I guess, for this particular season. Season number two. Let's get going. 
So I think next part we're gonna do some more, let's say, let's say some supercars. I feel in the mood to spend some, to spend some money. Hypercars. I'm gonna get in my P1 for now, but we'll see if we'll use that. So hopefully you guys have enjoyed. If you did, click that subscribe button down below, share it around with your friends. Anyways guys, thank you again very, very much for watching and I will see you in the next one.